the ship owner needs to realize the risk if they do not prepare in a way where their fuel management is very clearly defined to take into the consideration the tremendous diversity and range of formulations of fuels that is going to be facing them from one bunker to the next, they could run huge operational risks on board ship. This is fundamental one area that needs to be looked at very seriously that every ship operator needs to assess their fuel management program. That's where the first element of risk needs to be addressed. And there's some legal implications on that. If something goes wrong, whose fault was it? Was it the supplier or was it not?